Think of using in C++ as two power tools, one for clean names and one for clean constructors. First, we have two aliases here, using NameList with std vector and using PhoneBook with std map. These take the noisy template types and give them readable and intention revealing names. The code immediately benefits. Nameless team and phone book contacts read like domain concepts, not container plumbing. Unlike old type def, using also scales to templates, making it the modern uniform choice. Second, using can import members. Here, using person scope to person in employee inherits all of the person's constructors. So we avoid boilerplate code and keep the class focused on what's unique to employees. Now, constructing employee E with Diana and 30 just works without hard writing forwarding constructors. Uh, this boosts maintainability. If person gains or changes a constructor, employee stays in sync. A few notes here is that you can still add your own constructors alongside the inherited ones. Access specifiers still apply, and using doesn't change types. It only names or exposes them. The bottom line here is that use using to clarify intent, reduce repetition, and make your code base easier to read and evolve.